Keeps getting better and hotter because Cutie Patootie Bachelorette, former Bachelorette, Caitlin Bristol. It's so good to have you. Thank I'm you a huge you. fan. I girl crush. Yeah. You are the sweetest thing. Thank I'm going to say Jillian Harris and Caitlin are the most loving, endearing bachelorettes, Aww. and you happen to both be Canadian. I think it's a Canadian thing. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> um, also, we need to talk about your adorable glasses. I asked if they were <laughs> description. She has a story. She has a story. She has a story. It's a scoop. Of, it's you a decide sad whether story. It, you decide whether this is true or not. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> Sorry. So she's these, got, these she's are got not a black eye. prescription. I have a black eye. These are not prescription. But my girlfriend's baby. Sucker punch. My girlfriend's you. baby <laughs> sucker punched me right in the eye. But I have a lot of makeup on it and glasses, so we're okay. You look great. Thank you. you. I, I can't awesome. even honestly. It's there's a, a lot of makeup on there. Oh, okay. <laughs> you I know can't what's see it. so awesome for all things NBA All Star? You had access to something that only a privileged few get access to, which is Drake's share lounge. I know. What is that? You can only get invited, Kev. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, just rub it in. All those at the what? table who have been invited to J, uh, Drake's uh, Share Lounge, raise your hands, please. Because you know why? It's super exclusive. You're not allowed to take any photos, not even a selfie. I can't even talk about it. You can't? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> what happens in there? Uh, a lot of... Um, drinking. Yeah. Um, yep. And there's a photo booth in there, so there is pictures. Okay, so you can you, you could show people you it's, attended, but only yes. through the photo booth. Is it right. just like his video, where it's just nothing but a white box, but four walls and a white <laughs> box? Exactly like that. Yeah. <laughs> How was your weekend, guys? Uh, it was great. We uh, Later on, we're going to be talking about this new app, by the way, and yeah. I'd love to get your take on this. The People app, P-E-E-P-L-E. -E -E. it's, it's out of Calgary. It's actually relaunching because it was had so much controversy the first time. What it is is it's like Yelp for regular people. So, yeah, great, which is crazy. Regular. So, so yeah. if you, like, like, like anybody who's not in the public eye, who's not a celebrity, you know, for the most part, escape anything except in Facebook. However, this is going to allow regular people to rate each other and say what they hate about each other, what they love oh, about each is other. Is it only the negative people that are going to share yes, the story? Yes, it's going to be yes, bullies. For, sure. for yes. example, if you're dating in the dating pool, right, people aren't going to say, I had a great date, because then you would date them again and maybe marry them, versus somebody who had a bad experience or is tainted or is, and making stuff up, fabricating. But not just dating. This is regular this is regular I know the baker I know you Paul Schmidt neighbor. and he does this and he yeah. does that and he does this even if it, whether or not it's true so you are no stranger to having people yeah. on social media Make really put you down how does like, tell me what, yeah, what we're I feel in like for. that's just opening a door to a bunch of negativity like that's it's people's excuses they're like they're online and they're hiding behind their phone or mm -hmm. their whatever you know and they feel like they're invisible and they can say what they want and if they're having a bad day they take it out on other people and sadly it makes them feel better about themselves you recently tweeted we have it here Caitlin I want to say how much I appreciate everybody who has my back and supports me and understands the kind person I am some people are awful we know you experience the super highs and super lows of being you know on a show like The Bachelor mm -hmm. and expressing yourself and being you so how do you deal with the trolls and the bullies yeah, it's so strange. It was so bizarre for me to go overnight to people like having an opinion on me where I go my everyday life, I'm surrounded by my family and my friends and people who love me and say positive things about me to overnight where people say terrible things about me. Um, so it was just strange and I'm, I'm 30 year, years old getting bullied. So yeah. it's, you just got to ignore it. And, and you're the sweetest, most lovable bachelor <laughs> ever. What's wrong with people? I'll tell you what. i tell you what. You're on breakfast television right now. You're with friends. Uh, yeah. I want you people to tweet something positive. Oh. Yes. To okay. add Caitlin Bristow. Oh. Send her your yeah. love. Thank you. And you're on a little bit later too to talk positive. about fun stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why not? It is uh, 7 o'clock on breakfast.